Top of the morning to you laddies, it's me, your boy, Jack Spadicey. Welcome back to Infinite Survival, episode number six. That's right, today's the day. The house is going to be finished. The dogs are going to be named, oh wait, the wandering trader. The trader has interrupted us. Hello, how are you? What do you have? You have leads for me. Really, you came all this way for the lead salesman? Thank you so much. Uh, Lavas, oi, uh, you leave me alone. You leave me alone, you leave me alone. You didn't see anything it wasn't me it was this dog it was the dog take the dog all right all right it's not the day that we're actually working on the house it's not the day that we're working on the dogs either it's actually finally time finally to check out some new dimensions we got three dimensions to check out today i'm super excited these dimensions were actually chosen by you guys but uh before we talk about all of that stuff we need to enchant so uh, we have 30 levels. Fire Aspect 2. Okay, so, uh, we have, uh, a pickaxe. That's not very good, but, uh, we don't have a lot of diamonds, so we're gonna have to just enchant something here. I like the Unbreaking 3. I really, really do. Fire Production 4 is nice as well. The Unbreaking 3, though, ooh. So do we want Fire Aspect, or do we want Unbreaking 3? I think I want Unbreaking 3 on the chest plate because Unbreaking 3 will help us actually keep this chest plate for a long time. We can get the levels back and enchant for, uh, like, maybe a better sword. Uh, Sweeping Edge, yeah. See, right there, that sword is way, way better than Fire Aspect, at least in my opinion. So, boom. Enchanted Diamond chest plate, Fire Protection for Unbreaking 3. That is a pretty good deal. I like it. That's perfect. That's great. The beast ruined my farm. How could the beast? Come on. Come on. It's not cool. Not, not good. Not good at all. Alright, so if you're excited to check out the other dimensions, let me know by dropping a like. Today, before we dive into the other dimensions, we actually need to do a tiny bit of preparation work. Before the episode, I went down to the mines and got all of this obsidian. This is enough obsidian for three perfect portals. Not, not a portal like that, just a normal, uh, just a normal nether portal. Now, these portals that we're going to make today won't be taking us to the nether. We went there in the last episode, and, uh, we'll, we'll just say that was a thing. These portals are going to take us to brand new dimensions actually that were chosen by you guys i gave you guys a lot of responsibility and i think you guys actually passed the test these dimensions look really really cool i haven't seen them quite yet so when we go into them uh for the first time today that is the first time that i'll be seeing them i'm excited i kind of don't know what to expect hopefully you guys haven't set me up for a big trap hopefully but i don't think you guys have from looking at the replies we should be good now, uh, right here, what I'm digging out is going to be the Hall of Portals eventually. Basically, we're, we're gonna make, like, a nice room, a nice hallway with all of the dimensions that we've gone to. So, we could make another portal and go to a dimension and then just scrap the portal, or we could make another portal, go to the dimension, and keep the nether portal so we can go back to that dimension and get stuff later on when we're maybe trying to make, like, farms or something cool like that. So, uh, yeah, I think I like that option a little bit more. We'll keep all of the dimensions that we go to, and, uh, eventually, or today, or something, somehow, we're gonna try and label the dimensions as well so I can remember which is which. Um, I'm thinking maybe we, like... I mean, I don't really want to waste a bunch of levels. You know what? Uh, we'll, we'll just use signs today. We'll use signs to label the dimensions. So, this hallway. I, I think we could go ahead and go this high up. And, uh, here, let me just go ahead and clean this thing up so we can get into the dimensions. Okay, this is a whole lot better. Portal 1, Portal 2, Portal number 3. So, uh, we're gonna go ahead and leave a crafting table and a bed in here in case we come back and it's nighttime or if I need to craft something. Then we're gonna go ahead and make, uh, some signs as well and then probably a chest to put in here as well uh because i actually just realized i don't need to take the signs with me we need to leave our inventory free and empty today or as much as possible because we need room for the loot so the dimensions that we're going into today were chosen by you guys on this community tab post that i made right here the next dimensions that we'll be going to in a couple episodes time maybe next episode i don't know will be from the comment section of this video right here so today I chose three random dimensions, so they were actually the first, uh, like, top three. Not necessarily the most liked, but the first three comments that YouTube showed me. I'll probably do the same thing in the next episode, so if there's a dimension you want to see me go to, drop it in the comments and get people to like it. Uh, thumbs that comment up, and, uh, then we'll go to the dimension. We'll check it out. Dimension number one is going to be this dimension right here. 
Big shout out to our guy Angus for this dimension. In honor of the brand new Pigstep music disc, the disc is beautiful by the way, we will be going to the Pigstep dimension. Uh, portal right there and then I realized that I forgot the written book I need to go get a written book so I can write in it uh yeah that's my bad uh what do we need for that we need a, a piece of leather a piece of leather some paper just like that so we have a book then we need to go ahead and take the books the feathers the ink sacks and then written book one written book two written book three now we can actually go off to the dimensions that's my bad I did not mean to delay any further okay so the pig step dimension let's go ahead and just type pig step in here no caps always and then we can go ahead and sign it we'll call it pig step this time we do the cap of course because why not sign and close throw into the portal and here we go here goes nothing into the pig step dimension now to make things a little bit more interesting for you guys we have some rules with these dimensions oh no way we have lots of loot this is beautiful oh my gosh and all of these things too oh this dimension is good pig step is definitely confirmed good the blue nether blocks the only thing that could make this bad is if there were like enemies that started spawning but we have a rule we need to stay in each dimension for at least five minutes so if you send me to a dangerous dimension i, I will be big mad but uh it's gonna be good it's gonna be good We'll just have to deal with it and stay here because I can't just enter the dimension and then back out and leave. That wouldn't be cool. That wouldn't be fun. So I have a timer going. Five minutes is actually like four and a half minutes left. Should be easy to stay in this dimension. What is this? Is this a barrier block? Um, can we take it? I would love to build with barrier blocks. I don't think we can take it. Ah, oh, man. Look at down there. That looks crazy. That's like a bridge or like a like a weird structure. What do we have in the loot chest? Oh, starter loot. Oh, man. This is the dimension for wood. I will never mine a tree again, elites. I will never mine a tree. Wow. Look at this. The apples, too. We could jump right up to golden apples. Oh, this is amazing. The pig's up dimension is too OP. Wow this needs to be nerfed okay so do i want to take the wood i mean i'm kind of stacked right now so i feel like i'm just gonna go ahead and leave the wood let's go ahead and explore a little bit but uh portal coordinates 73 and negative 121 uh, the the fps in here is painful it's crying yeah i can feel it that that's that that hurts it's probably because of all of those things eventually i want to go into one of those things but maybe not right away uh this loot is crazy though this is the wood dimension wow uh but what is this is this a gap where we can fall we're gonna need to be really really careful here i hope this isn't like barrier blocks um okay no it's not it's not so we could go down right there that's crazy uh we need bamboo we need to find a bamboo dimension so then i can make scaffolding and actually explore these things uh you know what let's just go ahead let's just go ahead and start taking some of this stuff we don't really need to look in oh wait i can make a crazy storage room now i don't even need to make any trees i have all of this oh, okay 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 we have lots of random tools we're gonna need to dispose of those properly it is a big moment. It is a big moment. We will properly bear respects right here to the tools that we do not need. Tools, you are great. You were always great. You have been great. But you are not any more great. We do not need you. You are worthless to me. We will send you to the void, and I will never see you again. Disgusting. Goodbye, tools. Uh, they are gone before I could even see them. Good. I like the sounds of that. Uh, what else do we have here, though? We have some sort of weird thing down there. If I had Optifine, that would be amazing. We could zoom in. I'm sure there won't be any infinite snapshot Optifine, though. Uh, what is it? What is that? Is that... Oh, they're granite walls. Okay. They're cool. That's nice. It's, it's good. But I don't really need granite walls. So let's go ahead and say... Uh, the portal's over there. Okay, I can still see it. That's good. I don't want to go too far from that portal, just because if I lose it, then I will be very sad. That, that would be really bad. Um, can we take the slabs? Okay, we can take the slabs. So, these dimensions are pretty much just normal extra dimensions. Uh, the generation is weird and strange, but if you could normally... Oh, that's on fire. That is dangerous. That lava better not make it up here. Oh, what if this catches on fire? Okay, we're gonna have to be careful. Yeah, that's really bad. That is really, really bad. Um, yeah, that's dangerous. If that were to get up here, 
Ooh, that would be really, that would seriously be bad. Anyways, these weird dimensions are still also normal dimensions. You can mine things in them. I mean, as long as you can mine them in survival. So a barrier block, unfortunately can't mine it in survival. So we can't get it here, which is kind of the big bummer, but I guess it makes sense. But yeah, we can use these dimensions to our advantage and get a lot of stacked up loot. But taking a look at my timer here, I've actually been here for about five minutes now. This dimension is going to be really good for wood and loot. We're going to have to keep this in mind, but it is also kind of boring. Pig step dimension, I would rate this a, six, a 5 out of 10. Pig step dimension is good, but it is also boring. We're going to go home and go to the next dimension. And for now, we're going to go ahead and put loot chests in front of each dimension and sort of leave things in them. Uh, once I go into the dimension, I can kind of come back out and go back in and get more stuff whenever I need to. It's just the first time that I go inside of a dimension, I need to stay there for five minutes. I can't leave. And if I leave, well, I guess nothing would really happen, but I'm not I'm not, not, I'm not allowed to leave. Dimension number two. Dimension number two is the big meme, the big one right here. Title is Minecraft. The text is this spicy stuff right here. That's right. We got the end credits in this dimension. This is going to be the end credits dimension. Lots of text here. I am definitely not going to type this by hand. We're just going to go ahead and assume this is all correct. Copy and paste. All right. We can go over here. Oh, no. Oh, no. I cannot paste. I. Oh, oh no. This is bad okay yeah i cannot paste why can i not paste oh i'm not gonna type that all i'm not gonna type that all i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm not typing the whole end credits a compromise is beautiful a compromise is always beautiful we're gonna go ahead and take the first few lines of the end credit that'll work uh kind of sorry gamers um yeah we're gonna just go with it credits sorry to disappoint gamers but we're just gonna have to go with it uh, the, the credit dimension right here. We'll go ahead and light that on fire. There we go. And then finally, before I head off, I need to make a sign. Totally just realized I was meant to name the book Minecraft. Okay, okay, we'll pretend I named the book Minecraft. Into the credits dimension. What do we have here? Hopefully, this place is good. Okay, we have the dark end with Enderman everywhere. Okay, this is dangerous, and this is very dark. Okay, well, I have the torches. That's good. Oh, the glow. This is creepy. This dimension is really, really disturbing. I kind of don't like this place, but you already know what we're going to do. We're going to build a farm. We're going to go ahead and take some of this endstone. Endstone is great. This place is going to be great for getting lots of endstone. Assuming the dimension is sort of like this place right here where I'm standing, uh, this is going to be a lot of endstone. It looks like... Yeah, we have a void down there, and then some things in the distance. I can't quite tell what that is. Uh, I think it's more islands, but the fog is so weird. And we're, like, really high. Or, no, we're not. The clouds are just really low. Of course, that's, uh, that's entirely normal. But, gotta spend five minutes here. Of course, I'm gonna go ahead and spend five minutes here farming 100%. We're gonna go ahead and use this dimension, big brain move, to get all of the levels that we need to enchant all of our gear in the future. This is gonna be perfect. This dimension is the farm dimension. The credits have hooked us up, or at least the first few lines of the credits. This is going to be good. We don't even need to make an experience farm, which is something that I was kind of thinking about after that, uh, after that enchanting session. Like, how am I gonna get good stuff? So, Enderman Farm, is this looking good? I think it's looking good. Um, we want to go ahead and make sure it looks perfect. That looks perfect to me. We stand here. Oi, right over here. Come on. Come on. You, you come here? Exactly. Exactly. This is going to get us a lot of levels. Endermen are great for experience. Oi, come back over here. Let's go. Let's go. Exactly. That's what I thought. Okay, five minutes spent here. This is going to be easy. I'm going to go ahead and get a bunch of Endermen here and just take them on. This is great. Oh, boy. That sweeping S3 sword sounds so nice right now. We're going to have to get that, like, ASAP. Maybe even after this dimension, we'll go ahead and enchant. Hey, don't hit me. Don't hit me. We're, we're friends here. You see? Uh, yeah, they're all piled up over there. That's perfect. Okay, cool. This is going to be great for a farm and, and experience. Trust me. Once they decide to despawn, it's going to be good.
Okay, well, I'm not very efficient. I, I don't know. It, it's been five minutes. Uh, well, you know what? Now that I think about it, it's probably because I just randomly talked and stuff for the first two minutes, but it's been five minutes. I just need to get to level 30. Then we're going to go ahead and get out of this dimension. This place is going to be great. This is going to be so, so useful. I'm big hyped about this dimension. Oh, wait, get back here. Okay, fine. One more, one more. You, uh, you right here, right here. It, it's happening. It's happening. Yep, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, that's exactly what I thought. Exactly. All right, level 30. We've been in here for more than five minutes. Let's go ahead and get out of this place. But first, we'll go ahead and do torches right there. Uh, the moon is gigantic and blue. That's cool. Oh, we have towers over there. That could have been bad. Okay, well, we're, we're not gonna find out right now. We're not gonna find out. We'll find out later. Oh, man, I didn't realize we were so close to those towers. And it's nighttime. Okay, time to sleep. All right, before we go ahead and take a look at the last dimension, let's go ahead and enchant this beautiful diamond sword up to uh, Bane of Arthropods 4. Knockback 2, really? Wow. Wow, this sword is not worth it. Uh, got a lot of ender pearls too. We can find the end pretty easily now. That's cool. All right, whatever. Uh, <laughs> okay, uh, dimension number three. The final dimension that we're checking out today sounds like some sort of Roman emperor to me. It's called uh, Paulius. Uh, yep, just like that, Paulius. Yep, some kind of cool Roman dude, I guess. I'm, I'm not too sure, but uh, supposedly this dimension has a bunch of netherite where stone is meant to be. So we'll go ahead and sign and close that. We'll go ahead and make the portal right here. And then it's time to go into the netherite dimension pretty much and see if we have a bunch of netherite. So... Uh, hopefully we do. I think I I think the no, there's no nether right here. Oh man. Oh man, that's going crazy too. The sky is going crazy. Okay. Uh the lag is crazy in this dimension. It looks like we're in uh some sort of end e looking dimension. Um, what if we dig down? Okay, first off, this render distance is gonna have to go down if I want to exist here. Uh, video settings, render distance six. How about that? Can we, can we survive? No, it, it's the, the screen. Uh, the sky is going crazy. <laughs> okay, well, uh, this is a lot different than netherite. This is very different. Um, you know what I want to try and do is I want to dig down. If I go under the ground uh, and the sky isn't like being rendered, maybe, maybe it'll be a little bit better and I could do something for these five minutes. If not, it's going to be a lot of a lot of staring at the ground uh, because I have to exist in this dimension still. Oh man. Um, oh man. Okay. Oh, gamers, don't go to the Roman dimension. It's not working. This dimension is very, very bad. It's lagging like crazy. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, call it here. We're gonna we're gonna leave this dimension. I've been in here for like two minutes, but I make the rules, which means I can break the rules too. Uh, maybe I can get a better computer and then come back to this dimension and see if there's anything here. Kind of a big bummer. I was really hoping for the netherite in this dimension. Uh, maybe I typed something wrong. If I did, let me know. But yeah, I think the portal is this way somewhere. Oh man, this is an amazing slideshow. Oh man. All right, I hear the sound. We're gonna go ahead and trust the sound. Are we going back home? Um, maybe we're trying. We're trying to leave. Um, okay. Oh, I made it. I made it back home. I thought my game had crashed. I thought it was done. I thought the game was done for. That was going to be really bad. We're back home. That dimension is very, very bad. Do not go. Do not. We will not be going back to that one. That was dangerous, but I think that is actually going to be just about it for the three dimensions that we're checking out today. So, I wanted to use today's episode as a little bit of an experiment. Do you like how we did the dimension hopping? Let me know down in the comments below. Do you have a dimension that we should be going to? Put the book text exactly down in the comments below, or the dimension will unfortunately not work. Thank you all very much for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, turn the notification bell on. Today, I'd like to send a big shout out to my patrons, I am Blur and Mr. PD Wash. Until next time, elites, stay fresh, stay cool. Goodbye, everybody.